who's going to be the farmers 20 years from now. This is a, kind of a unique partnership between a community council and a business development organization. This will be LEDC's St. Paul offices when the construction is completed in about six weeks. Having this marketing cooperative means that all these small farmers can now access these much bigger bigger markets. I talk with, um, with the LEDC people and they give me business classes for, for build my uh, business plan. There's a variety of classes offered through our TTOIC uh, Latino Academy. And so this is going to be space that they will utilize and that means that people don't have to travel from St. Paul all the way to Minneapolis. These vegetables are coming from one of the farms and they're going to put them into the cool, the, the cool van. One of the issues in farming is the average age, age of the Minnesota farmer, and this is true nationwide, is 57 years old. That means there are a lot of farmers in their 60s, they want to retire, their kids don't want to be farmers, or they don't have children. On the past I grow just four crops, broccoli, bell peppers, and garlic. But this year, because we, we have more contracts, we're going to sell eggplant, uh, onions, cabbage, cauliflowers. Community development means drawing people out of communities. The people that live in these communities give them an opportunity to fulfill their dreams, to own their own and develop their own businesses. That creates a real community.